guys a little bit update on my industrial terrain as you can see since my last video I already did some uh, a big amount of work and from my last video you already saw that I finished the barrels but I also made these kinds of this kind of pieces from a Coca-Cola Sprite cans you basically can use any cans and what I did I just glued it on on some styrofoam, added this metal uh, wiring here, a little bit of steps made from brass that you use usually to pin down your model models, and these hands leftover pieces from your uh, old rhinos. So there's that. I really enjoy how this came out. So I have two of those and one at the back. The one on the back uh, is more... You remember the two cans that I glued together? I basically separated them, did some testing. The one can broke and the other can survived. So I just spray painted it, called it a day. Glued on some of these uh, rhino pieces as well. And of course I made some fences here. And they came it came out very good, but the problem is that this wiring is metal and so all the edges were very very sharp you could easily cut yourself on them but when I spray painted I noticed that they went a little bit dull so more paint slapped on the upper house and it will be better so some of the fences are smaller like I showed you the first one the other ones are longer and I also made some uh, a beaten up effect like uh, maybe plasma shot through it or a tank just sm smashed it all I also have these kind of pieces holes and everything on top so basically a different kind of variety didn't do any more work on this Actually, I don't know if you remember uh, if it was shown in the last video, but I added these marbles on top, and all those will be my light effects for the landing pad. But other than that, guys, there's nothing more to show you. Everything is primed, everything is ready to paint. When it's ready, and I put my jungle terrain around it to so better. Uh, the only thing I can uh, do is set up some models to show you how it will look. And here you have models on the terrain set, a little bit confrontation between Chaos and Elder and unpainted terrain needs unpainted models. Now uh, you have painted terrain, you need painted models. So that's it for this little update. Hope you like it. And the next time we see this terrain it will be fully painted and ready to be played on.